Good morning, my beautiful friends. I'm here. This is Jeanette, makeup artist, pro makeup artist. And I want to let you know that I'm getting ready to start working uh, on a eye makeup look um, based uh, on the Mega uh, Celestial Nirvana palette from Pat McGrath. This is how the palette look I've been announcing the makeup look with this. I will be doing several looks with this palette because it's just mesmerizing. Uh, the payoff of this product is actually amazing. I'm in very in love actually with this palette. I love everything from Pat McGrath. Um, but this colorful palette uh, need justice <laughs> by working with them uh, more than once. So, uh, so far, what I did uh, on my face, um, I did prime it, okay, with my Must Go Derma Chill Skin Protectant. You can get it at uh, Amazon. I use all the time this because I use my eyes and my face a lot, you know, for makeup. So this is an amazing product to protect your skin since produce a barrier between your skin and the product, okay? And I did a set it with a Makeup Forever Ultra HD Micro Finishing Press Powder. Okay, this is from Makeup Forever. Um, also, uh, I did conceal my eyes already with Gosh Concealer. The shade in this concealer is the lightest one. I love it because I have a tiny little yellow and when my eyes um, are a little bit tired because of my workout, I love to use a high coverage concealer for my dark circle. This is infused with the Argan Oil Vitamin E. I love the product from Gush, okay? Um, also for my face, I want to tell you I did use the YSL Blur Primer Silver YSL. I use this all over my face to primer. I love it because it's like applying silk literally to your face. So, okay. Let us start then on the tutorial. I want to surprise you with what I'm going to do but it's going to be colorful, okay? So stay with me and uh, don't forget to subscribe to my channel and give me a thumbs up if you like my work. I'm very new on the platform of YouTube, but um, I'm nothing but a heart, you know? I'm not making money, nobody's sponsoring me, but I really want to teach. I really want to share all what I'm being given, you know, through the years that I'm being on the makeup field. And um, I think it is the time to start giving. So stay with me as I'm going to start, you know, this amazing makeup look and, um, and I will be showing you the process. Okay, see you in a little bit. With the same brush, I keep refining the, the graphic line. is 
mesmerizing the pigmentation of this product. Again, it's this green, then you can see in the very corner, alter the state. So now I'm yeah. going to proceed with the pastels, this yellow, okay? To make a transition on the outer. And blending, blending, blending. A little bit more in this shade. What I'm doing is defining a little bit more the, the graphic line, okay? I'm going to start shaping the second graphic line, okay? This is uh, the tricky part. Why? Because your eyes are not the same. But it is our responsibility to make it even, okay? So I'm going just to follow my natural curve of my eye. I want to start diffusing the edges.
so by diffusing the edges the line start getting thinner and thinner okay So I'm using a tiny bit of this yellow, pastel yellow, okay, to make a, a smooth transition. And I'm touching both color at the same time. I say I want a very defined line. So now, with this brush, from actually this one is from Sigma, I'm going to pack on the paint. And to place the paint in the middle. Yes. And I'm trying to get very close to my lash line. So there. I'm going to wait just a few seconds until the product dry. Meanwhile, with my concealer brush, I'm going to keep refining my graphic line. Okay. The symmetry is very pretty. I really like it and I want to show you I will be using my amazing my Kiko okay because with my Kiko there are my small buds 
from my kid go you know what I'm doing See the intensity on this line because I want to be really intentional about the noticeable, you know, overlapping of the lines. So I'm going to apply this on top of the paint. I place there and I'm going to draw another graphic line and go all across the way okay like in this eye So I will be clean out of game, out of uh, recording, just to make this area neat, and I will come back when I'm ready to apply the blue color there. Okay, I I was cleaning, you know, the fallout of the eye, and I'm going to apply the deep blue from this palette, and it's called. Uh, let me see. It's called Nocturnal Navy. Nocturnal Navy. Okay, I'm going to apply that shade very, very close to my lash line. It's a beautiful shade as well. trying to get the most that I can from this palette. I've been using so far one, two, three, four colors, okay? Which is uh, the navy, the green, uh, the blue, the very shiny blue, and um, a yellow shimmer that I did tiny little bit apply on the center, very tiny, because I don't want much on top since I'm putting you know um, a, 
a contrast color and they don't touch in between them. Uh, they can be, you know, uh, you can be working with antagonist color, but don't touch it, don't mix it. Otherwise, it's going to look muddy, okay? But now you can be working with graphic lines like this, okay? So let me clean one more time and I'll be back. Hello, hello. Um, okay, I cleaned my lower uh, eyelid and um, I was retouching a little bit more the graphic line and I end you know, applying some very tiny little rhinestones in between the two graphic line. So if you want to see the process, I will show you. So more or less, um, I just place the eyelashes and I am uh, eyelining my waterline, my upper waterline, but in the bottom, it's going to remain natural because it is a lot of going on in this makeup look, okay? So that way I can show uh, this beautiful shade, the shimmer blue metallic finish in a full effect. So, and the most is on the upper, you know, with a graphic line. I hope that you really enjoy it. And um, for uh, my waterline, I've been using a hero line from uh, Hindage. I love it. I didn't use my gel pen because uh, I don't want to run the risk of any kind of transfer, my lower eyelid. Okay, if not, that is going to ruin the cleanness of the blue that I did apply. So the fix and mix and fix drops, okay? With a tiny, tiny little bit of my concealer to cover this ugliness that I have there. So what this product does, I've been explaining already. This help you to alter the, the shade that you have. For example, the shade can be, in this case, this specific one, the is 001, is to um, enlighten any foundation, okay? It's like a white. You can tell that white so I will be mixing it with my concealer that I'm using today then from our glass there is is a shade birch that is the lightest one as well as neutral so Hi, my beautiful people. I'm here again with a final look using Pat McGrath, the Mega Celestial Nirvana Palette. This is the presentation. These are the colors. One more time. I use four or five shades from this palette is what you see on my eyes the blue the green the lightest a gold and um, I will be posting on my link every single shade if you want to try this look I think it is very stunning um, uh, the payoff of the shades okay it's easy to work with those uh, shades it's easy to blend it's easy to make graphic line with a product because are highly pigmented then you need just a tiny little bit to make it happen oh, again then you really enjoy this uh, today makeup look uh, you would love for me to teach something uh, different 
something about beauty, uh, care, um, how to take care of your skin, how to begin the day, you know, your day uh, with uh, some routine and taking care of uh, your skin, more for my mature uh, skin ladies than they are watching, I'm more than happy to share, you know, a, a routine that is working for sensitive, normal, oily, and combined skin, okay? So, um, if you want for me to do uh, a certain look from this with this palette, let me know and I will make it happen. Uh, don't forget to subscribe to my channel. I'm here just by pure heart. Um, nobody's paying me for doing this. Uh, I buy all my product. I don't have a sponsors. My only goal is, is to teach, okay? is to teach, teach, and teach. If you learn something from this today makeup look, I'm more than happy. Let me know. And again, give me a thumbs up if you really enjoy this makeup look today. And, uh, and I'll see you soon, okay? God bless all. Bye. Bye from Texas. <laughs> Bye.